kind of celebratory music? Yeah. Yeah, what are you doing today? In this morning's Money Watch tax extensions, we all know the deadline is midnight, but if you can't finish your return by tonight, you can get more time if you ask for it. Our financial analyst, Ray Martin, is here to tell us how. Good morning, Ray. Hey, good morning, Harry. Who is a good candidate to file for an extension? Well, you, you simply haven't completed your tax return. You need more time. I'll mm -hmm. give you a couple of examples here, okay? All these tax credits out there, making work pay tax credit, American Opportunity Tax Credit, right. yeah. deductions home for owners, new homeowners, homeowners all bought a new stuff. vehicle, yeah, yeah. Stuff. you're not sure you're getting all the benefits of those on your tax mm -hmm. return. You need more time to do a good job and research all those. File an extension. If you just gave your information to your tax preparer right. and you're saying, hey, can we get it done today? Don't do that to your tax preparer. You Relax. Fi file an extension and give right. them, you know, come back to your return in a couple of weeks when you can go over it line by line with your preparer. If you got corrected 1099s or K1s from partnerships, you haven't gotten those forms in, <laughs> right. file an extension. Give yourself some breathing room, but you got to do it. You got to ask. The form for more is time. called 4868. Form 4868, automatic application for six application for automatic six month extension to file your tax return mm -hmm. when you file it. You can download it from IRS.gov, file it by paper. There's only three lines on the form that you wow. have to put on your your, your income, it's easy what to you do. owe, what you're gonna pay. Really easy to do. You can even e file it on the IRS.gov right. website for free. Here's the deal though. Yeah. So assume you do your four eight six eight and, and you do it online. That you still have, you have state though, right? Well, you know, a lot, you of, people, a lot of people don't forget talk about that. It. People think you file a, f a federal application to uh, to extend your tax federal right. return. It doesn't automatically extend your state returns. You mm. have to file an extension for both mm -hmm. for your state returns as well, and that's a separate form. You can get it from your state's website. Right. Okay. So okay. assume that I file this four eight six eight by yep. midnight tonight. Yep. When do I have to pay? If you want to avoid underpayment penalties, right. you have to pay today. That's why you know, April 15th is such a tough day for people. It's payday. Right. It's not that you file an extension, but you have to pay your taxes today with check in the mail or with an automatic deduction from an account. And, and you've got to pay at least 90% of what you owe if you want to avoid uh, you want to avoid underpayment penalties, right. and you have to pay all of what you owe if you want to avoid extra interest. Right. The interest that the government yeah. charges is not so horrible. It's, it's a, what was it about four percent? It's a yawning four percent. Not a right. big deal. So at least pay ninety percent of what you owe or more. Because that's okay. really okay. So yeah. you may not have all of your T's because crossed the penalty and for and underpayment I's is dotted right. exactly. Yeah. So file the extension, but you still better write that check. That's right. Exactly. All right. All right. Uh, file an extension is an extension to re to file your return, but not an extension to pay your taxes. All right, here's my question. Very yeah. quickly, if you're getting a refund, what should you do with your money in 20 seconds or less? Yeah, you know, the average refund is about $3,000 for folks. If you're getting that cash, pay off high interest rate credit, credit card debt, like 7% interest or more. Like uh, contribute to a retirement account, or use the money to get additional job skills and invest in your education, because in this recovering economy, it'll help you get a job. Good advice. Ray Martin, as right. always, thank you. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.